All right, Eric, go Huskies. As the first round of the tournament goes on, there is a lot of excitement, as you can imagine, happening at the campus in stores. There are plenty of people buying UConn hats, T-shirts, and that coveted Husky gear. News 8's Tina Detail joins us live from stores with a closer look at that. Hi, Tina. Hi there, Catherine. You know, just about every person who came into Ted's restaurant and bar and are standing right out front are wearing Yukon Huskies gear. Now, as students, a lot of them already own this gear, but there were also plenty of people who are at the Yukon bookstore today buying more gear, except for one lucky dog that we ran into on campus. Do you have anything to say? <laughs> Thank you for the kisses. The only one here on the Yukon campus who never needs Husky gear to show his school spirit is Jonathan himself. Big fan of Jonathan. <laughs> his name, image, and likeness are hot sellers at the Yukon bookstore. So we're getting some Lululemon gear, getting a March Madness t-shirt and a crew neck. Danielle Lacanti is thinking about attending UConn next year and being on campus during March Madness may have just sealed the deal. Definitely, it definitely makes my chance you higher. Are, you want to be part of it? Yes, I do for sure. Even Jonathan is excited to have both the men and women seeing tournament action. <laughs> After the men play Stetson today, the women take on Jackson State at Gamble Pavilion on Saturday. We're ready to get into March Madness and start beating some teams, so he's excited about that. Right now, this bookstore has March Madness and Big East Championship t-shirts, but some people are waiting for a couple of other t-shirts to arrive before they buy. They have their sights set on the big dance and beyond. I'm other hoping sweat. for a championship t-shirt at the end of the year, at least minimum a Final Four t-shirt, but we all know that we want, it. We want a natty here, so I'm gonna get that. I want to get that natty shirt if they come out with them. And this is really just the beginning. Of course, all the folks here are hoping that the men advance today and the women do the same tomorrow. We're live in stores. Tina Detell, News 8.